Also following the latest on a fire new this morning that happened around 2.30 in the morning in San Francisco's Bayview District, here is a new picture that we just got into Cron 4 where you can see the, the flames. This is from one of our viewers sent in to us. Uh, we're also live on the scene there in the 1500 block of Hudson Avenue with Cron 4's Jackie Sissel. Hi, Jackie. Good morning, Daria. You can see some of the damage caused by that two alarm fire to one of two buildings that forced eight people out of their home and injured that one San Francisco firefighter. Now, according to the firefighters, the fire actually started over here. Now, this is an abandoned house. There was also a carport attached to it, and that's where they say the fire actually started around 2.30 this morning. As I said, fire department uh, officials got out here around 2.30, found that the carport and part of that house was fully engulfed with flames. Now, the house next door was occupied by eight people, including one child. All of those people were able to get out without injuries, which was good news considering the time of day. Now, as far as the abandoned building, according to firefighters, they say there was lots of stuff inside of that house. They don't know if it had been accumulated by people that weren't supposed to be staying there or if the owner was just storing stuff. Either way, there was lots of material inside that house. They believe that's where the fire started. Along the way of fighting the fire, one San Francisco firefighter was injured. We had a chance to talk to a battalion chief earlier this morning, and he describes an incident that caused those injuries. No, he's good. He's, he's, I hear he's good. He's, he's got a swollen ankle. We don't know the extent of his injuries right now, but he's being treated at a local hospital. How was he hurt? He went out onto a deck. He was advancing a hose line and went out onto a deck and stepped through, the, through a soft spot in the deck. Do you know? And once again, Daria, this is the house that was abandoned or empty, I should say, vacant. That's where they believe the fire started. There was a carport between these two homes. This is the home over here where the people were actually staying. You can see the damage done to the exterior of it. And you can, uh, according to the San Francisco Fire Department, they also say that part of the fire reached into the attic. That's why the people have been out of their homes. And it sounds like they're going to be out of their homes, at least for most of the day today. Uh, obviously, as firefighters go through there and make sure everything is still fine and uh, okay for them to go back into the home. Eight people displaced by this fire, Daria. All right. Thanks a lot, Jackie. James.